What's up, fellas? Welcome back to another video. And today, we're doing a what's in. Okay, if you like nature, you'll love it because the birds are chirping like a mother trucker. So today, we're doing a what's inside my tackle bag video. This is a flamboo, zertrist, or whatever backpack style and, uh, if you're new here there's a giveaway going on my channel so stick around because I will be now I will be giving you the details somewhere in this video so stick around we have the top pocket we have the top pocket this part right here two rows of line both of them are spider wire 165 pound 130 pounds. Got old plastic. It'll be remelting down one day. Got a cheap Amazon scale. This was ten dollars. I've got owl. That's a hook. I've got my homemade zip. Ow! Shit! It hooked me really well. But if you ain't seen the last video. Won't hook a fish. There's my homemade lure right there. I'm definitely gonna be trying it out again. Uh, I had this drying out so it wouldn't get rusted. This is a Dugan Squad casting jig. Blue gear color. Another old plastic. Need another flush. All my soft plastics. Every single bag. Almost every single bag. Every single bag that I want to take. Got some Googans in there. Got some Carls. Got some. You name it. I got it. On the side here, we've got zip tied fillet knife on the side. Just in case I catch a few crappie and bluegill while I'm out and about. Got a flat skillet too, so I can cook them on up. Let me know if y'all want some catch and cooks. On this side, you can put a rod, whatever, or my tripod, whatever. This pocket right here has these tennis juicy worms, jelly worms. These are good. I'd recommend them. They are long, they are big, but you can always cut them down to size, fellas. Got those in there. I've got GoPro stuff in there. That's what's in there. So this side, basically the same thing. I've got GoPro stuff in there. But the moment you have all been waiting for. Boom. This little waterproof bag I have to clean out. I have all my used plastics. I might melt down and make some lures. You just got to let me know. But I'm going to get me a mold one of these days. But um, these are all my boxes. Box number one. This is stuff that I... This is the box I throw stuff in when I or, need to organize. So that's not where it goes. None of this is where it goes. Stuff that I left laying around, I just chunked it in there. Bottom half, whatever. It's it's hard to open. That's that box. It has some Carolina rig hit. This box got the nice catch co sticker on it. This has a handful of spinner baits. Here's one. This is a Guggen Squad spinner bait zinger with the saucy swim. Pretty sure this one of them dollar ones at Walmart. Pretty sure that's another one. Shout out to Mystery Tackle Box because that's where I got that one from. The white blades on it. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Now this one, my all time favorite spinner bait in the world. The War Eagle Sartreuse. <coughs> Sartreuse color. War Eagle. They are high, but they are good. This one, it's a rag doll. Peach crap. I don't know. If I even use that again. 
there's another Walmart one. So, and I've got all my jig heads for Ned Rigs. All these jigs, these casting jigs, flipping jigs. I've got this one. It's kind of messy. It needs to be washed off. Got this one. Came in mystery tackle box. It's pretty good. Decent size. This one came in mystery tackle box. It's decent. I like it actually. And this one came in mystery tackle box. Mystery tackle box be hooking me up. It's not where I keep my frogs, but got a frog in there. Hula popper and another little frog. That's it. This box holds buzz baits and a bunch of random oh, buzz baits, terminal tackle. Basically, it. this box is for catfishing, snagging, whatever you know, big fish box right there. Big weights, big hooks. This is my kayak box. I throw whatever I think is going to be good for that spot with the kayak right now i have in here a western swim bluegill swim bait a red square bow crankbait oh never mind bait bullshit the guggen squad jerk bait i think it's called scout and three chatter baits you can let me know down in the comments what kind this one is get a shout out one of the expensive ones. That's my kayak box. This is my crankbait box. I've got square bill, I've got deep divers, I've got lipless. You name it. It's gonna get boring if I just show you every single one of them. This one's got all my jerk baits, my prop baits, which Prop bait sat out in the heat. I don't think that's good anymore. <laughs> I don't think that's good anymore, so I have to probably take that out and melt it down. You know, whatever. Got a popper. Another jerk bait. And that is it. That is what I have as of right now. Mr. Tiger Box hooks me up every month, so every month these box get, boxes get fuller. So, in a few months or so, I'll show you what else I've got. I've added to the collection. But that is what's inside my tackle backpack. Oh. June 2020. Alrighty, fellas, if you've made it this far into the video, you have a chance to enter and win a giveaway. All you have to do is subscribe, turn on post notifications, comment twice on this video, Sh share it if you want to, you don't have to. There's a link down below for some merch, a uh, pretty cool shirt. Um, or you can cash out me $5 for an extra entry. Doesn't matter, you don't have to do it. Doesn't really matter. Do what you do. Anyway, those are the steps. Winter will be announced at 10,000 subscribers, and I'm growing fairly quickly, so it won't be long. Anyway, I'll see. Oh, yeah. Only my true fans are going to stay to this far. So, new. I don't know if I'll be able to upload every Tuesday and Friday now. It's probably only going to be Tuesday. So if I don't upload a video on a Friday, don't get mad. I have two jobs now. I have a kid on the way. And I can, only, I can probably only do one video a week. Unless I record two in a weekend. So, I'll do my best. But expect a video every Tuesday. And maybe one on Friday. Fish hard. Go home. I'll see you fellas next time.